so weird. But here we are, the number one undefeated, number one seeded rather, undefeated, highly anticipated, X-rated, Mad Titans, Diablo versus number six, Bopip. Get him the clear to join. What up, Firefly? So you coming with the hype? Sin is ugly in real life. <laughs> Here's Sin. Shot. Tucks it inside. Cohen comes in. Tries to finish it up, but Big Bear captain for Bobip. Is able to get the save. Shot on. MF moves. Is going to be our first goal of the series. Can I get a... Oh, yeah. Looks like Argonaut was back there on defense, but Moose just great placement for him. And the Mad Titans fans in the chat are going to be loving this off to a hot start already. Of course, they've been enjoying a, a very good season. You know, dare, dare we say perfect. Looking for the 10th win, the last win of the season, going 10-0! So far, so good, Sin is on the board! Cosmic Lord says he's still ugly, I don't care if he could play Rocket League, I don't care if they go 10-0 undefeated, he's ugly. And Firefly says, Sin is my dad, I don't care how ugly he is. <laughs> Nitro said the shot was ugly. Look at Moose. He gets the initial touch, follows it up, but Big Bear again. I think it's a second save for him in game two. Here comes Cohen around the bend, around the corner. Dropping down. He's behind the defense. This looks a little wide there. And it is off the right post, and we get our first demo. Get him a body bag. Yeah. And Argonaut can't get that one just wide by inches. And Mad Titans, Delta going the other way. Not Delta, Diablo. <laughs> Delta does exist. That team does exist. But this is Diablo, another demo. Here comes the cross. Argonaut's already up in the air, but can't get his Fennec on the ball. Big Bear coming around from the corner. And that moves. Sends it away. Double commit there. Bopip. They, they need to do their best to, to not panic. They're, they're definitely in this one. They had an open net miss. And a, a lot of time left. Even if you don't consider what, what's happened, what's led up to this. Here comes Cohen. Around and Haken. Have it. I think the first time calling his name this game. So he lets the ball go over. Here comes Sin. What a slice! What an angle from Sin! I wouldn't venture out there, fellas. This sniper's got talent. And if Nitro Cloud didn't like that last shot, he might like this one. Tucks it right into the net. Great slot and ability. Mad Titans Diablo up 3-0. Bopip. Gonna have to, to battle here to not get shut out. Sends the other way. Sin trying to wave dash across the field. Cohen's already up off the crossbar. And Sin comes in. Tries to get possession. Tries to get the shot. Gets really neither. And there's Cohen. Sends it up high again. Bopip desperately clawing. Trying to get this ball away. No touch here. Big Bear sends it to the wall. Cohen. Touches 50 going the other way. Let's see if he can read off the wall. He has a hundred boost. Sin drops it down, dinks it under, and Haken gets the save, gets the clear. It's going the other way, racing towards the blue side of the field. Going off the wall. Ball gets put to the other side of the field. MF moves, looking for his second goal, but no, Cohen comes in. And gets enough on it for oh Mad Titans Diablo. Up 
A minute 47 remaining here. Here's the kickoff. Big Bear's up on the wall, gets enough on it, but drops it down right into the other captain's lap. Here's Haken off the side wall. MF moves going around the corner. Haken touching. Drops it down, leaves it for Big Bear. We have a demo on the field. <laughs> I'm in danger! Looks like Cohen was getting rid of a, an extra shooter. Good on him. Moves dribbles it down. This Argonaut, I think he was going for the redirect, but I, I'm left here wondering what happens if he doesn't touch that ball. Does it does it go in? Does it waterfall down? Does it is an easier shot? But his uh, redirect attempt was essentially a, a clear, and, and we'll just never know. Under 50 seconds now. Moose, silver in the neighborhood. Cohen is there. There's a 50 Argonaut into the play. He's looking for a dribble, but runs right into the captain of Mad Titans, Diablo. Pops straight up. Cohen, nice shot. Nice adjustment, but a good save by Argonaut outside of his net. Big Bear with another demo. Cohen can't read this one. Here comes Moose just cascading down the field with the ball. And Bope, if they, they, uh, you don't want to start a, a series, you know, whether it's best of seven, best of three, best of five. You don't want to get shut out in game one. But it looks like that's what just happened here. Down to the turf. Mad Titans Diablo do take game number one, three more for them, and they they are in it. They have first place. They'll take the entire season. So something to note about Bopip is they advance to grand finals, I believe, on a on a forfeit last week or a disqualification. I wasn't. I'm not aware of the circumstances of that. But depending on, on the situation, they may be out of action for, for a week, maybe more, maybe a week and a half. I'm not sure how much that would affect them. But we are ready for game number two. Zite, appreciate the follow. Appreciate you joining us. 50 there from Argonaut. MF Moo is going to ride it up the wall. Coming out of the corner. Sends it away. It's dropped down. Here comes Cohen on the wall. Has enough boost to put it over to his captain, Sid. Off the post. And it's off the left post there. And look at Cohen. Pitches up against the crossbar. Works it in. Oh my god, he on X Games mode. And that is something that he has put on great display for us. Is his aerial control. Nitro Cloud, that was a, a new sound bite. It's I don't know the commentators, it's RLCS commentators. And they accidentally uh synced up saying off the post. <laughs> no no, you heard it. You heard it. Here we are. Now we're seeing some some su support for Bopip. <laughs> Cosmic Lord might be talking about someone being ugly. Hold on! First goal! Bopip and not quite what a save! Impressive. What a save! I, I thought that was going to be the first goal for Orange. But it was not the case. Just a great defensive effort. I didn't even see who got it. I apologize. So we'll credit the whole team, Mad Titans, Diablo. And yeah, if you are just joining us, hold on, touch there. MF moves, if you are just joining us, Bopip was shut out in game number one. And now moves up to no good, extends the lead 2-0.
So Bopip still searching for their first goal. Mad Titans Diablo, that's all they do is score apparently. And they're just starting to lean on this number six seed of team. Now there's another demo. Ready! But appreciate the follow, Al the Swagmaster, not Zero Sev. Appreciate you guys joining. Zero Sev, this is a uh, IGL. This is a uh, indie gaming league. There's some information there for you. We are wrapping this up. It's the grand finals, week number ten, week number four of the playoffs, and Sin can't be stopped. Pay him. Pay that man his money. Cosmic, appreciate the tip, man. Always appreciate it, never expected. But look at Mad Titans Diablo up 3 0. Oh, they're looking to end their perfect season with some fireworks. And here comes Cohen. We know he could get busy in a hurry. No touch from Big Bear. Here comes Argonaut. He has a slot. No, Sin just drives into the play. Coming out of the corner. Here comes Haken. Has to get back on defense. Shot saved. Sin and Argonaut on the play. And moves right back in. Look at the shot there. Off the post. Off the left post there. But Sin won't miss. Right down the pipe. Off the wall. Look at Sin. Just about halfway done with game number two, 229 left. And game two is looking a lot like game number one. 4 0 here, Bopip still struggling to, to find the net. And Diablo just looks way too fast. Cohen goes off the post again. Sitting down off the wall, Cohen comes in. Saved by Haken. And Nitro says, I bet this game just kills Bo Pip's morale. It could. It definitely could. I mean, it's it's very deflating, but this is my first time casting them. I don't I don't not too familiar with them at all. I don't know. You know, they might be very, very headstrong. They might believe. They they still might be enjoying themselves, but yeah, from the outside in, this would uh This would demoralize even uh even the most strong willed teams. But we'll we'll see what they have here. They, they have a lot of Rocket League left to play. Even after this win, they will get at least two more games. They just they just got to settle down here. But let, let's keep wa watching. Momentum can switch in a moment. And here comes Big Bear, captain for Bopip. But he gets robbed. Sin looking to drop it down to his compadres. And Cohen can't get to it. MF moves. Crossing, crossing, crossing. Could be shot at. Haken barely with the save off his own post. BT is <laughs> trying to give Argonaut a hard time here. Here comes Haken. Sends a shot just to, to test the water, but MF moves more often than not. He is just so speedy, very deliberate when he is playing defense off the wall. Coming in, Sin sends it away. Argonaut chasing it back to the corner. And Moose sends it over the backboard. Seconds left on the clock. No touch for Moose. Haken. And Argonaut and Sin with the save floats it over. Haken gets a great stop. Is able to high point at it midfield. And Sin, what a launch there by Sin. That might be on target, but Haken is having none of it. And let, let's talk a little bit about Haken. Didn't have too many plays to his name in game one, but I have liked what I've seen so far as this series goes on. Looks a lot more involved in game two. He looks like he's he's up for the challenge to, to play toe-to-toe -to -toe with this very talented Diablos team. Diablo. We're gonna get some extra time here. Had, ball needs to hit the turf once more. But the teams aren't ready for game number two to end. And you would understand that perspective if you're if you're Bo Pip, you know, still looking for their first goal. Pitched two shutouts against them. 
And let, let's see here. They have five shots to the four saves from Mad Titans and 13 shots from Diablo to the five saves of, of Bopip. And that is pretty much going to give us a perfect idea of the, the landscape here in this matchup. But it, it can change at a, a moment's notice. Let's see, both people, let's see what they got. Let's see if they're ready to, to make any mid-series adjustments. <laughs> MF moves. Sends it the other way. Going to the wall. Moves going toe to toe. And I think that was Big Bear there on defense. Haken is there. MF Moves coming up, gets around him. And there's some net here. There's some open space. And Haken is on the board. Big Bear with the assist. <laughs> So here we are, not only does Bopip get their first goal of this series, but they also get their first lead of the series in the same play. You saw the effort there from the team as a collective. Big Bear and Haken just dogpile into the net to just ensure the, the goal, because believe you and me, it was well defended. As we saw there, here's Cohen with the dunk. Wins on the 50, keeps it in the orange corner. Moves, corner. Coming out, shot by Sin. He has been so good. Hey, that's pretty good. And that is just great team synchronicity. MF moves. Some people will tell you, leave the ball out of the corner. Don't even bother with it. But he knows that someone on his team is going to be back. They're going to be looking for that pass. They're going to be able to shoot it and effectively... And we see it there. Cohen goes up. Might be an easy pitch in for him. And it is. Cohen high points it again. And they are up 2-1. Can I get a oh yeah? So Bopip gets their first lead of the series. But in less than a minute, Mad Titans Diablo not only get the tie, but now they regain the lead. As we have about four minutes left here. Diablo just... Just pelting this this orange side of the field with with shots with with goals, and they have definitely done a great job maximizing their possessions. This one gets behind. Here comes Big Bear, flaunting his Fennec, sends a shot on, and before it hits the post, Sin gets a save. Floats it up. Big Bear try to catch it to the plate and does enough. Sin can't get it on the touch. MF moves. Sends it over to Cohen, who was in the neighborhood just a little too high, a little too awkward. He had to go way left to even get his, his fender on it. Big Bear drops it down to the turf. Kick it down. Passing three-minute mark. Metro Boomer wants some more. And Sin going the other way. Gets it, and this is what we've seen from Mad Titans Diablo. They are so good in transition. They are so good turning defense into offense. And look, they won't let up. Here's the waterfall, and here's Sin. Been calling his name so much tonight. And Moose here credited with the assist. Keep the change, you filthy animal. And with... Mad Titans Diablo, not only the number one seed, but also undefeated. You, you kind of have to anticipate that their whole season might have gone this way. Off the post! Here's Cohen. Gets a dunk on the wall. Low on boost. He's going to just try to get something. It looks like a fake there. And here comes Big Bear. Another demo. Crossing, crossing, crossing. No shooter on the other end. Hold on. Here's Argonaut. Double touches it. No, can't get that one to go either. And here's Dusty. Dusty comes in with some Haken love. I, I like Haken. I like how he's played. He's he's only gotten better. And 
to say things haven't gone Bo Pip's way would, would be a gross understatement. Touch here, Cohen. Shocks it up, sends it away, keeps it going. MF moves is on the other side. But great defensive sequence by Bopit. Yeah, but that backflip though. Hold on, there's a floater, and Sin is there. And this is how good. This is how good Matt Titan and Diablo have been on, on offense. We're not even talking about the fundamental things that they're doing so well. We're talking rotations, we're talking positioning, and they, they have really pitched a, a perfect game in that regard as well. And that's that's why Bo Pip has had such a hard time finding the finding the net, finding success on the offensive side of things. Here it comes across. Big Bear catches on the other side. And just immediately, this is how relentless Diablo has been. If as soon as you get the ball, one of them is tackling you. One of them is is on you in your face, making it uncomfortable. Haken with the high point, sends it on, Sin can't touch, and Argonaut gets the shot and hold the phone here. This one won't be so easy. Bopip cuts the lead to one goal, 42 seconds remaining. This one's against the wall. Popping out. Great time waster here for Diablo. They just need to grind out these last 30 seconds. The Big Bear's on the play. Good cross there. It is shootable. Argonaut had the shot. Had space to work with. And we are tied. From Haken up to Argonaut in the outlet. Great play here. Can I get up? Oh, yeah. And we, we see what happened. Cohen has lagged out. They're going to have to play this through. 16 seconds left. And let's see if Bopip can finish strong here. Sin playing awkward. It's a 2v3 currently. Let's see if they get Cohen back for overtime. Pitches against the wall. Fight. And Cohen does rejoin right at overtime. Let's see if it helps. Argonaut going the other way. He's sticking with it. Looks like he knows exactly what he wants here. But Sid is going the other way. He's going to go toe-to-toe, -to -toe, face to face with the other captain. Big Bear waiting on it. Puts it inside another demo. Get him a body bag. Yeah. Shot there from Cohen. But no rebound touch from Diablo. As there is a lot of action going on at midfield. Big Bear may have the last thing to say about it. Goes off the crossbar. And Big Bear wins a 50. Sin at front post. Floated over the other side. Cohen. Tries to encourage the clear. Aiken and Big Bear get turned around. What a clear by Big Bear. And now Sin, seeing what he could do. Gets it over to Cohen. Cohen drops it in. And Bopix looks so good right now. Able to, to tie it up, take advantage of the 2v3 of the disconnection. Sin gets a touch. Haken keeping pressure. But Argonaut runs into Cohen. Cohen needs some boost. I think he might have got it a hundred. And a great pinch there by Sid. I think he was going for the 50. I'm sure he'll take the pinch as well. 50. Next goal wins it. Golden goal rules. Ticking upwards up to the two minute mark. There's a lot of extra time here. And credit to Bopip. Here's another demo. Why would you kill him like that? MF moves. Floats it over. Tries to get the redirect. And we have the raid from Pyro J. Please check him out if you don't know him. Another one of our community casters. 
as we are just ending the season tonight. What up, Pyro J? What up, Raiders? We have a, a lot of game left to play here. Hold on. Off the backboard. Cohen turns around short cycles. But didn't get the touch and the 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 land that he wanted as Sin off the post. Cohen! MF moves! Stays patient, but Hagen with the great play! Impressive. Here's the touch for moves. Big Bear going out. Now both is doing such a great job on defense. Hold on. Maybe I spoke too soon. No, Argonaut keeps my dirty little mouth shut. Plays it well. Haken sends one back. Moose sends it to his corner. Another demo. Get him a body bag. Yeah. 50 down to the turf. Moose, we've seen this pass out of the corner. Sends up for it. They, they hit on it again. They hit on it again. It's a different corner, but the result is the same. Mad Titans Diablo with another win. The closest of the series. Obviously, it goes into overtime. Hats off to Bopip, but we have at least one more mat sorry, one more game here. Sin. A hat trick MVP performance. Two saves. And look at this. 14 shots from Mad Titans Diablo. Nine shots. From Bo Pip, seven saves for them, and they really, really played their hearts out. We were talking a little bit about about morale and and how that must be for Bo Pip at the moment, and that is deflating too. You do enough, you play the best game that you've played on the series, and still lose in overtime. Pretty backbreaking as well. But I, I'm a believer. Bo Pip is making a believer out of me. They've fought here the whole time, so we'll see. <laughs> Here's the kickoff. Haken eats a 50. Argonaut gets out of his corner, but Sin, he likes shooting out of the corners as he drops that off the crossbar. Cohen to the wall. Sin was there. I thought he, he would get the goal, at least a closer shot, but just sails over. And Sin has just been flexing and flying and doing everything he's been able to touch it seems like every every ball that he wants and it is match point for Diablo they are one game away from capping off their perfect undefeated 10-0 season what placement by Sin I love the shooting clinic he is putting on tonight. I wouldn't venture out there, fellas. This sniper's got talent. Just tucks it right in, upper 90, to take the lead 1-0. Diablo's looking for a sweep here. Hold on, good. Good play here for Bopit. There's 50, there's a dunk. Cohen with patience, gets the fake. Still has possession and he'll take a 50. Argonaut on the defense. Sin sends it away. Moose drops it down. I, I, I think he was trying to get a back pass, but Cohen was already in the air to, to shoot on the initial, initial touch. <laughs> And we've had at least one demo every every game here. There's two. <laughs> I'm in danger. This one gets over. There's a 50. MF Blues chops it away. Another demo. I'm going to come at you like a spider monkey. I told you, they're not going anywhere. They're going to keep hitting each other. They're going to keep playing really, really hard on both teams. But here comes Argonaut. Pops it up. Leaves it for his captain. Big Bear trying to get it over, but his... The rest of his team is pressed up against the goal as well. Unable to, to chip that rebound in. Aiken 50s too. Cohen coming around. Behind most of the defense, Argonaut gets the weight. Side rolls into the 
into the play. Out of the quarter. And a 50 there, shot and save. Going off the wall. Drops it down, crossing, crossing, crossing. Puts it in, and just like we saw from game number three, Bopip, they've been getting better as the series has gone along, and game number four is definitely sticking with that trend. Bopip up to snuff here. Only a one goal differential here. Two minutes left. And, you know, it doesn't take much to get just one goal, just one kind of just sneaky little, maybe something like a pinch or maybe an own goal for the other team. Look at Big Bear! What a play by him! And that is exactly what I was talking about. Impressive. Passes up to him, self reads it off the wall beautifully, and Big Bear is not ready for his season to be over. He wants first place, second place will not stand for him. And you see him there making his case. There's Sin dropping it down. We know how good he's been all night. MF moves, sends it, Sin with the touch. Here comes Haken. He's trying to get a self pass, maybe trying to take a page out of his captain's book, but never comes off the wall. I don't think he liked what he saw there. Hold on, Big Bear. He's in trouble. But Sin's first, hold on, out of the corner, back to Sin. I thought they were gonna do it for a third time. Not the case. Touch here from MF moves. Argonaut with the 50. Midfield, no touch from Haken. As Moose lets it get behind him. Argonaut with the 50. Hold on, this might be a score here. Shot save, Cohen on defense. Big Bear coming around. It's floating over to orange side of the field. Cohen keeps it going. What a touch there by him. Here comes Argonaut. 50s. And we're, we're still tied. We may have another overtime game in store for us. Because we are under half a minute. I'm going to come at you like a spider monkey. Another demo down to 15 seconds. Argonaut trying to get one last word in. Big Bear sends the shot. Sin comes in to make the save. Hold on. Seconds remaining. Time it expires. I thought perhaps on the buzzer beater. Fight. But we will get a second overtime. Hold on. That, that ball is going straight for the net. MF Moose just gets a touch out of desperation. And I, I think the recipe for Bopip and their, their improved performance is definitely taking up space on the field. They're meeting Diablo's aggression with aggression of their own. There's a demo. Retro Boomin wants some more. Big Bear going the other way. Preserver Boost gets a 50. This one's going over to the blue corner. Cohen can't touch. Sin sends it away. I think he wanted the shot. He'll have to settle for the clear. And yeah, right there, Haken is just playing quick as, as is the rest of his teammates. Hold on, Sin. This might be it. The last goal of the season. Not quite. Cohen even came in for a second shot. And Moose comes in to help out. 50 gets over. Big Bear with the dunk. He's going to go up. Captain on captain. Right there on the wall of the sideline. Cohen's by himself in the net. He lets this one through. Bumpip will not be swept. And depending on how you want to look at things, perhaps they're ready to orchestrate a reverse sweep, but Bumpip in overtime. Series is now 3 1, still match point for Mad Titans Diablo. Already up here, and Big Bear is the MVP. 
Even if it wasn't points related, he had such a great shot. One of the better ones we've seen on the series. And I, I like to think that was able to, to light a spark underneath this team. And it obviously was the tying score. But let's see what game five has in store. <laughs> Sadie, we have the number one seed undefeated, 9-0 versus number six, Bopip. Touch it, here comes 50. So Diablo, they, they don't want this. They, you know, a, a sweep is nice. It's, it's very hard to get an IGL, especially in grand finals. But... You, you don't want to let a talented team hang around. They might make you pay. No touch there. Cohen fought, battling out of his own corner. Moves gets up and grazes the, the ball just enough. Now Cohen gets possession. Gets a pop. Stays into it. Catches again. And 50s. What a shot by Cohen! This is a good play. That was a very good play showing off his dribbles. You saw him dribble, win a 50, regain possession, and then make a fake on two defenders and just contort his body to get a great slow shot. Here comes the infield. Cohen sends it off the post and back into the goal. MF moves. Scores goal number two. Can I get a oh yeah? And hold on, Mad Titans Diablo. They look, they look re-energized. They look refocused, and perhaps they think that they left Bopip off uh, off the hook here. As moves sends it away, Haken. Catches. Yeah, but that backflip though. And just an unfortunate backflip for him as he was trying to continue with possession. And Cohen loses connection again. If you're just joining us, this also happened in game number three, and he rejoins immediately. Which, uh, which I, I really want to think allowed Bopip to get their first overtime. Uh, a game that they would ultimately lose, but Cohen's... Hopefully, for him, he, we don't have any more issues. And he just gets strong in the orange paint here. Moves. We know he likes passing out of the corner. Keepers, mister. You're really strong. And Cohen comes in just flexing. Looks strong and sturdy as ever. And jams that one in. Cohen sends it. Off the crossbar. Double commit there. Three minutes to go here. Bopip. I, I'm not ready to, to, to stick a fork in them quite yet. I've, I've seen too much moxie. Too much guts from them. Look at Big Bear. Getting creative. Pitches it against the wall. Tries to negotiate the goal. Tries to roll it in. Yeah, but that backflip, though. As Cohen will, will backflip. I'm not sure if that was a cancel. We'll get the sound effect going anyway. Nitro Cloud says, Matt Titan starting to pull away. And that, that's indeed what's happening. However, it is a good goal to, to time left ratio right now. Two and a half minutes. Three goals needed just for the tie. But they, they have to get going. Here comes Big Bear. He showed us how good he could be in the air. And drops down, gets a 50. But nothing more as Haken comes up, inserts himself into the play. Cohen on a breakaway, gets behind the defense and finishes it up. Cohen. Pay him. Pay that man his money. He's he's had his uh his issues with, with ping, with disconnecting, but when he's not doing that, he is making plays. 4-0, Mad Titans Diablo all over Bopip in this one. Haken just, just trying his hand, sends it over. Bopip was able to avoid the sweep, but I'm, we might not get much more than that. 
as time is just bleeding off of this clock. Second by second. This is another demo. Why would you kill him like that? Touch here. MF moves with a great pass, great cross, but no shooter for him. Argon on the wall. He tried to go for patience, but Sin just goes straight dunk on it. A minute 20. And this is where Mad Titans fans can start getting excited here. Ticking down to, to 60 seconds. And this may be the way Diablo's season ends. Dropping down to the turf. Big Bear floats it over. There's the demo. Get him a body bag. Yeah. And Sin, he's going to take the scenic route over to the net. He's going to go long. He's going to get smacked up from behind. And another demo. You can't tell these teams that it's a, a four goal differential. With 30 seconds remaining, they just won't believe you. They're just playing full speed ahead, ears pinned back. Sin with the cross. Here comes a decent set, but we are down to 10 seconds. This one is over. Mad Titans. I know we have a lot of support from them in the chat. We're going to be hearing a lot from them. GG's indeed. Good series. Good season for Bopip. One more. With zeros on the clock. 5-0. Real Cosmic Lord says Sin is still ugly. It may be the case. But he is a winner tonight. A winner on the season. And let's see if I can get a post-game interview from, from Sin. He usually takes them. I just I forgot to confirm with him before the before the match. This is kinda last minute. And let's let's see if we can get him in. Okay, and it, okay, so we will get a post-game interview, but it'll be with with Cohen. Let me go ahead and prep for that. Just be a few moments here, chat. Again, GG's all around. Let's see if we can kind of capture this excitement. Real Cosmic Lord says, tell him he's ugly. Well, it's Cohen that I'm uh <laughs> that we're gonna be interviewing. Here he comes. Hello. Hello, sir. Can you hear me all right? Okay, hold on. You're a little quiet on my end. I can turn you up. No big deal. All right, try again. Hello. All right, much better. How are you feeling tonight, sir? You're first place grand finals champion. How are we feeling? I'm feeling great, you know, mad excited. Just a good feeling, you know. Yeah, <laughs> and then oh, your your man, your man A Wash is coming in with the raid. Let me show him some love real quick. I Ooh. think uh, who won the other Mad Titans game? I'm not sure. No, let let's see if A Wash uh, can can tell us. I I know he just got done casting that. Let's see real quick. I'm sorry. All good. Alpha. Okay, so what? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Back, back to you, sir. You're, you're feeling good. You had a very good uh, series. Is that, is that usually 
uh, the, the level of success that you're used to in this series, or was uh, tonight just a little extra special? Um, that's usually how we play. Um, okay. Yeah. Usually. Okay, and then you had... Really yeah, right. Uh, you had the uh, the two disconnections. Is that typical as well? No. Um, okay. <laughs> my game just randomly crashed twice. Wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> and that's that. It's not something that you've had to deal with uh, throughout the season or in the past much. No, that's never happened to me. Oh my God! It could have been a worse time. Grand finals. You know, you guys were never too much in in hot water here. You had the two overtime games, and and uh, it, uh, you'll hear me talk about it on the on the cast. But I think it was your first disconnection that that may have allowed that game to go into overtime. You know, you you went AFK, and then you eventually. Yeah disconnect and they and they score what was what were you guys saying in the in the chat because so it wasn't a connection based it was uh your game you're saying so you're able to, st to stay in comms with your team then yeah so okay. they were just trying to play passive and defend but i mean it's hard to 3v2 but i mean it still worked out in the end and we still won the series so it's all good right 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 so i got al the swag master tell cohen Alyssa says she loves you and your swag <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love you too, Alyssa. <laughs> Aw, shit. I've never cried on stream. I might. I might. You <laughs> knock it off. I'm not sad. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, no, man. You're you're the champion. You come on this channel, you do whatever you want. Go go for it. Um so so let's see. I usually ask the captain, but Sin, you know, he gave you the interview. Who we who are you giving the game ball to? My vote will be you, but we're talking to you, so so what what do you got? Um you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to give it to myself. Oh, shit. <laughs> Swagmaster. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. That's that's fair. But, you know, I'll, I'll joke it aside. You guys did look uh, look incredible. I think I had one or two of your your matches this, this series. Not too many. Let me see here. E yeah. Yeah. Okay. Maybe or maybe not since last circuit, but you guys, you guys looked incredible. Uh, obviously, you're you're undefeated, ten and zero. Must feel great. Let's just go ahead and recap your your journey through. Oh my God, they were all sweeps. Yeah. Round uh, one, three zero. Uh, quarterfinals, three zero. Uh, well, first you beat Delta in round one, and then you beat Senior Series Esports three zero, and then last week Team Jumba four zero, and then Bopip is able to to take a game off you here, you guys. Yeah. Weren't able to get the sweep. You weren't able to keep the streak of life. Shame on you guys. But yeah. uh, go ahead. Um, yeah, that's just unfortunate. Um, but we still win. So right, you know, it, everyone history won't really remember th little minute details like that. It's a very cool little caveat. But uh, but no, no, it, it's just that first place trophy that you'll get to 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 flaunt. Is this your first uh, win for IGL? First first place. Uh, yeah, this is actually my first season ever in IGL. Oh my god. Yeah, I think Sin mentioned that a little bit when he when he handed the the interview to you. So, man, congrats. <laughs> some people, you know, I want to say some people have all the luck, but with how you played tonight, it is completely earned. I, that was, there's nothing lucky about it. Maybe the only lucky thing was finding um, uh, two teammates to just a team that you mesh so well with. Um, how, how did you guys meet each other? Um, we just met through the, uh, Mad Titan server, through looking okay. for group. I had no one to oh play with. God. They, uh, Moose first picked me up. Sin was in the middle of his, uh, playoff run while me and Moose were playing. Yeah. But we started playing with Sin during his playoff run, and then we just kind of decided to become a team after their playoff run. Wow. Wow. So, not much to it. Just, hey, I need someone to play with, and then it turn it translates to a, a perfect season. That's incredible. <laughs> Well, I, I love it. I love it. I don't have too much for you. The floor is yours. You get shout outs, uh, any plugs that you have or anything else you want to talk about that maybe we didn't get to, to mention or we didn't discuss. Feel free. All right. I'd like to shout out Alyssa for supporting me throughout the season and all the Mad Titans members and fans who come out to every game and cast. I'd like to shout out Moose and his hot dog addiction because that pushed us through our game. <laughs> and I'd like to thank Sin for being the captain and uh, dealing with captains who yes yes who have the I, schedule wow 
That that might have been a, a to end a perfect season. You have a perfect shout outs. I feel like you didn't leave any stone unturned there, and I appreciate the you showing love to your captain. People don't understand that it is such a thankless job to uh, <laughs> to to schedule everything. You know, talk to other captains like you're saying, report scores, you get everyone together, coordinate schedules. Oh my god, I don't miss it. I do not miss it. Um, so I, I really like the shout outs. GGs to you. Um, Thank you. Anything else from you, sir? Nope, that's it. Awesome. Good talking to you. Congrats. Oh, actually, one more thing. What, what are we doing? Are we celebrating tonight? What do we got going on? Um, nothing. <laughs> nothing? Okay. No, actually, I, I forgot. What's, tell me this about this hot dog addiction. Oh, um, Moose just loves hot dogs. I mean. So how many does he eat? What are we talking about here? Um, approximately five to ten a day. Shut the fuck up. I'm not. I'm no, jo I'm joking. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, because that is addiction level. You, you had me. You had me. <laughs> wait, wait. No, but seriously, on a weekly basis, how many, how many hot dogs is he putting away? I don't know actually. He just is loves he... hot dogs. He doesn't say how much times he eats them. These are the these are the things I need, Cohen. You almost gave me a perfect interview, and now I'm just gonna not be able to get to sleep tonight thinking about how many hot dogs <laughs> Moose eats a week. <laughs> My... Swagman said Moose likes to sing taco songs. That true story. All right, so he got tacos, and he was singing a taco song in the background. <laughs> <laughs> was it was it good? Did it rhyme? Was it an original? I don't know if it was original, but it was really good. Oh, okay. We're, so we're going to have to get them signed. So you guys are yeah. going pro in Rocket League. You're starting a band, and you're doing it all for the love of hot dogs. Yeah. Swagmaster says it was vibey. <laughs> I want to hear this damn song now. I need to play it uh, for, for some hype music on one of my streams. Oh, my God. <laughs> I need to get Moose to do that for you. All right, but actually, before you leave, so we had nearly 100% support for, for Mad Titans Diablo. I, I ran the predictions before. I think you even uh, bet on yourself, you little scamp. Yeah, I did. I, I so, put in uh, 774 points, so, I think. Yeah, so we'll pay out that. I, there was only one one voter. I think it was uh, old Deep Pockets Nitro Cloud, but I, I think he had a very modest modest bet. He just likes the underdog story. But yeah, yeah. but now now we'll kill it. Now I was a liar before, but that is all I have for you. Any any other closing words from you? Uh no, just great season overall. Great season, man. Congrats. Uh, are you guys staying together next season? I keep I keep talking, chat. I'm sorry. <laughs> I am not sure. We'll really? See. I'm not 100 percent sure. No. Wow. Okay, that won't put you on the spot more than that. There's it's a big decision. A lot of things to to discuss and. I don't know. I, I'll i speak on behalf of Mad Titans. And I think it'll be a damn shame that such a good team that wouldn't re-up uh, for the summer circuit. Oh, I got one more shout-out. I forgot. Please, I go ahead. Uh, I'd just like to shout-out Mad Titans for picking me up and, you know, making me making me win the championship. There we go. There we go. You kind of you kind of covered it. You kind of covered it. You said uh, yeah. everyone in the Mad Titans organization, which is pretty blanket. I agree with you there, but yeah, but you you got it, man. So good, good talking to you. Thanks for coming on uh, on the interview, and uh, you yeah. know, good luck in whatever you decide to do. Then, all right, thank you, man. Peace. Peace.